it's not your time. Agent Sean, you're just in time. From this seat, I will harness the power of Iacoth's super weapon and lay waste to your eternal alliance. Step away from the throne, and you can end this war right now. Oh, I will end this war in spectacular fashion. Witness the last gasp of your pathetic alliance. Asina, no! Beautiful. I see a radiant empire, infused with the Force, built by the Molten Gods. They're gracing me with the super weapon's power. It belongs to the Sith Empire. That weapon killed an entire species for trying to harness its power. If you think you're in control, think again. You are blind to the truth. No! The gates are closing! The throne is rejecting your input. You've lost your hold on the superweapon. No! I can still see it. I know what I must do. They are coming!
You were right. I've awakened the gods. Nothing can stop them. You're wrong, Asina. Whatever you woke up, I'll find a way to stop them. No, Commander. Soon, you will join me in death. I have to admit, I respected her. For Sith. On the bright side, that power flux knocked out the superweapon's defenses. And killed the signal that put our ships in lockdown. The Eternal Fleet's back online. It's about time. Commander, I'm detecting massive power spikes at the superweapon facility. Let me guess. That's bad. More like catastrophic. The weapon core is charging and no one's at the controls. If you don't deactivate it soon, it may obliterate the entire planet. Don't worry, Lana. We'll handle the superweapon. You'll never reach it in time. Hold on. With the shields down, I can remotely slice into the mainframe from here. Maybe buy you enough time to manually kill the weapon at the source. Do whatever it takes. In the meantime, tell our forces to take shelter. Be safe. Both of you. You too, Commander. Eternal Fleet, move into position and charge all forward batteries. It's time to knock out a superweapon. Sir, live.
Darren, I've reached the super weapon facility. How do I shut it down? You'll need to interface with the main controls. Look for a throne, take a seat, and hope for the best. I've seen two thrones on Iocath, and both were occupied by dead bodies. I don't want to be the third. I've seen a cut corners, but you'll be sitting on the real deal. Let's hope that's good enough. Time's running out. Hurry! galaxy rebuild. Who would try to destroy me? One, mark my anger, pain, hope eroding. The betrayer lured you to Iotath, igniting war, spark the engines of rage, envy, passion, hate, sorrow. The betrayer now offers you Sacrifice Prime, fuel for the Six Gods! This doesn't have to end in violence. Calm down, and let's talk this through. There is only rage. Commander, you're safe. I found the super weapon. It was a giant droid. I know. You've been talking in your sleep. I almost had to stuff a sock in your mouth. Whatever that droid is, you knocked it out of commission with the Eternal Fleet. Now it's recharging and gearing up for a counterattack. Which is why we must strike soon. Hesitate too long, and the Titan may destroy us all. The droid was obsessed with rage. If we're going to destroy it, we may need to keep it calm. Or push it over the edge. That's good to know. We need every advantage we can get. Too bad the droid's the least of our worries. Someone sabotaged the throne while you were plugged in. Any chance you saw them? No. But the droid said it was the same person who lured us to Iocath. Someone close to me. The conspiracy cuts deeper than we imagined. Sounds like an inside job, all right. 
Only a handful of people could get close enough to sabotage the throne. Who could have done such a thing? You're my spy master, Lana. No one's better positioned to stick a blade between my ribs. Well, I'm glad that's out in the open. If Lana's under suspicion, you better add me to the lineup. I am the better spy, after all. How kind of you, Theron. Then there's Malcolm, Ago, Visla, Satil, the entire Alliance army. Whoever it is, I want them rooted out. Quickly. There's only one solution. You must monitor everyone. Hold on, Minister of Paranoia. You can't invade everyone's privacy to sniff out a single rat. I can't. But the Commander can. Give the order and I'll begin surveillance of everyone. Even Theron and myself. It's the only way to flush out the traitor. I won't let one traitor turn me against my followers. They've earned my trust. I'm glad someone hasn't lost their mind. Trust is a risk. Now more than ever. Commander, I knew you'd pull through, and back in fighting shape, no less. I hope you're ready to return to the front lines. We struck down Empress Asina and stopped the apocalypse. I'd say we've earned a moment to celebrate. I'll drink to that, but don't celebrate too hard. We need you back on the battlefield. You won a major victory by neutralizing Asina, but the Empire refuses to surrender. They're still fighting tooth and nail for control of Iokath. They're still desperate to claim the superweapon. If we take it first, they'll have no choice but to surrender. Then that's where we set our sights. But we can't stop there. We need to keep hammering the Empire. Day by day, hour by hour. Only then will we win this war. Now if you'll excuse me, the battlefield's calling my name. I'll see you on the front lines. We'll track his movements, see what he's hiding. I'll promise you right now, whoever this traitor is, we will find them. And we'll make them pay. I know you will. While you start searching, I'm going to win the war they started. For the Eternal Alliance. May the Force serve us all. <laughs>